Okay, this is a solar spider care video. So, what you want to really do, of course, open up. I need to take pretty thick stick like this, put it in. Um, don't want it to be too long. Break that a little. See? It's like a nice little, little hide. And that's just another piece so we can make it web, like it could be down here hiding, and then when something is trapped, it goes up. And then, you don't really want to add any dirt, you don't really need any decorations, but that's for the housing, no substrate. You don't really need any rocks either, just a stick. And then, what you want to do next is you for feeding you just if your cell spider is like I have three so let me get it out As you can see, my solar spiders containers are like this. They have a connect stick, and then the solar spider just build off of it. Um, this one, you could also use popsicle sticks. Solar spiders, solar spiders love it actually. That's his little hive. It's killed all the whole bunch of bees. These bugs. Zillow spider got a lot of bugs too but as you can see I do not have a lot of decoration on the pieces so the solar spider will probably build up and down like you see in my solar spider webs um and then for feeding like for mine they're pretty big so I can give them like small flies you don't want to give them green bottle flies and get them little spiders but um, you wouldn't really be able to see the attack. You could give them little baby crickets. I mean, you could give them ants. They're pretty efficient. Um, you can also give them like little bees. I have a, in this container, I have a little bee. It's like, it's not really a bee, it's like a wasp. But. That's really all you need for a solar spider. <coughs> um, well, good luck with all your solar spiders, and I hope you do good with them. Um, if you have any questions, just put them on the comments below.